vintage ads from 1963 from a Life magazine. Uh, I have several Life magazines. I'm going through them, pulling out some of the ads, and then I'm going to donate the remaining of them to a nursing home because they use it for um, activities. Look at this. Tom McCann, bootmaster. And how much were they then? Oh, ho, ho. $13.95. I find this fascinating. I have this one up. It is the F85 Cutlass. And this is 1963. A lot of times people that are restoring old cars or people that just have a passion for cars, they like these kind of things. Ah, this is a Portaroy color camera ad. Uh, color in 60 seconds is only half of it. And you know, Polaroids are coming back in vogue. I don't know which ones, but there are some Polaroids that are right now trending. And that's not up. Butane lighters. Now this is not a full page. This is just a half page. But then the thing is what you have to do is you have to look at sold listings and eBay to see whether or not your particular ad has sold. So then you'll know whether to bother about putting it up. Walton watches. Oh, and if you find one of these for 1963, well, if, if, this is just really good. You have a lot of people that collect watches. Now, this is for the stamp collector. This is not going to go up, but this is a three-penny bonanza, and I have a friend that collects and knows about stamps, so I'm going to share that article with him. It's not going up. Here is an ad for Ford 1963 Ford Fairlane. Now, the thing about these ads, too, the photography, simply awesome. Look at that perspective, the little boy in the middle of all of those flowers. And then in the background, almost in the background, like, uh, we're not going to pay much attention to it, is that Ford Fairlane. And then there's a lot of good copy here. My daddy gets a big charge out of our Fairlane. He says it handles like a cobra, which I thought was a snake. But he says it's a sports car. My mommy likes it because it has room for the whole family and doesn't cost much. I guess I like it too. But I feel kind of like a sissy holding these flowers. Ha! <laughs> I love this. It's a great copy. It's a great photo. And sometimes I think people might collect these just because um, it's just so awesome. Some of the ads and the time that was put into them. But I'm still learning. This is a stainless steel PAL injector blade now the question is especially if you have something that's no longer on the market this is the pal brand so you have to look it up and say is pal still around and then to see if it's collectible because it's not around and it's talking about that brand so that's just a few i have more and I'll make that another video. Okay.